these are endless summer hydrangea cupcakes yes. and I know that because um, uh, I like hydrangeas and I they're bluish purpley looking and you can get them in Jersey but right now we had a blizzard so you really can't see any of them hey everybody Crumboss here hi Crumboss I am making these cupcakes because believe it or not I had a dream about Joseph Palomar earlier in the week okay and I was making these cupcakes and I was giving them to him Okay, so he's one of our friends on Facebook yeah. who helps out the Crumbos and the right. producer Joseph very much. Joseph Palomar on Facebook and on my blog, guys. He will help answer any of your questions. He's wonderful. He knows his stuff. Yes. So when I'm not available to answer you, he's right there, and he's been really a great help. So for whatever reason, I was dreaming about Joseph Palomar, and I was giving him these cupcakes. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. So Joseph, these ones are for you. So All right, yes. so Joseph, and the summer hydrangea cupcakes, and the crumb boss is going to show everybody how to make them. Yeah, that's right. Um, this was my first attempt at this, and I mean, they're okay. I'm not that thrilled with them, but... Um, okay, let's just try to make yeah, them. Yeah, I mean, basically I had some icing color drama all afternoon, as you can see. Uh, I started off with that color, I went to this giant bucket of this color, and then yes. I finally settled on some lighter blue. Okay, so, so what's um, in the pastry bag? A little combination of all of those things. Okay. So yeah, that's the key, guys, when you do make the hydrangea, is that in your pastry bag, when you fill your pastry bag, you want to um, fill half of it with the lighter blue and then half of it with the purpley color, and that's what gives it this effect of the bluish purple when you do pipe them out. Now, the recommended tip for this is going to be a Wilton 1D tip, which is a pretty big tip. Um, but basically, I mean, you could use any of the um, regular star tips, and you just want to kind of push the prongs in a little bit more yes. so that they're not sticking up so much. Okay. Um, and the technique for this is pretty simple. Um, maybe I'm overthinking it a little bit, but basically you just want to kind of squeeze it and turn your tip as you're doing it. Oh, this is definitely a cupcake that I couldn't make. Yes, absolutely you could. It almost looks like you did. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> no! I'm not that Gretchen. crazy about how they came out. Why? I think they came out beautiful. Really? Yeah. Okay. All thanks. the stuff you make is pretty. Thanks. But here's the thing about Crumb Boss TV. Everything that she makes, everybody, looks beautiful but tastes amazing. That is true. Right? Yeah. That is true. So you get your recipes, guys, on crumboss.com. Get your vanilla cake, or you can make chocolate cake ones. And the uh, Swiss buttercream is to die for. It's like the most raged and raved about recipe on the whole internet right now, I think. Yes. So that's how you do it. You just kind of make these little squirts on. So you squirt, twist, and pull. Squirt and twist a little bit. Squirt yeah, and as twist. you're turning your squirt cupcake. And twist. Yeah. Yes. And that kind of gives the effect of those little hydrangea petals that are just so pretty. That is really cool. Right? Now, again, you guys, you could buy your pastry uh, bag kit on crumbboss.com. Yep. And, uh, you know, um, and then you could be like the crumbboss 2 and make cupcakes that look like this. The crumbboss 2 or the crumbboss also? Or the crumbboss also. <laughs> Or the crumb boss number two. What were you doing with that other little pastry bag? Oh, this was just my practice run earlier with a smaller tip in that same design. Okay. I just did it in a little uh, paper bag. That's all, right. all. So here you just learned. What would you call this technique that you just did, though? Hydrangea. Okay, hydrangea. <laughs> okay, we just made hydrangea cupcakes. And I just popped them in here because I thought it looked no. Cuter. I think they're. I think they're pretty. I definitely think they're pretty. All right. So that's how you do your tips. That's how you make the hydrangea cupcakes vanilla cake recipe number fourteen on crumbboss.com. <laughs> it's a joke. I'm kidding. And uh, and that's it. Get on Facebook, guys. Make your hydrangea cupcakes. Share it with us there with the group. And uh, we'll catch you later. Crumbboss.